What's up, everybody? My name is JMac. If you're new to my channel, make sure you unsub. Ugh. Today, we're doing a tier list on the best thing I've ever discovered in Smash. It's been known. This has been a thing that's been known for so long. Basically, you get Wario. You get a fighter. Wario eats the fighter. Boom. The fighter turns into Big Chungus. It's absolutely genius. I don't know why I didn't think about doing a tier list about this so long ago, but now we're doing it, and we're going to do it good. So sit back, relax. Enjoy the video, peeps. Have you heard of Raid Shadow Legends? Oh. Hey, all you Polybians watching right now, have you heard of Raid Shadow Legends? There's no way that you haven't. Have you actually played Raid Shadow Legends? Raid Shadow Legends is a dark fantasy RPG game and it's free to play. Here's some gameplay of me playing Raid on the PC for the first time. I got to use a portal and I got to pick my character, Gallic, which is a badass fighter and chosen for close combat, which is my kind of playstyle. You get to do things like battle clan bosses, battle raids, dungeons, campaign, arena battles. It really reminds me of an old school RPG game and I love old school RPG games. And don't worry, if you're playing on mobile and I'm on PC, we can still play together. Look up my username jmacyt because Raid Shadow Legends is cross-platform between mobile and PC users. So go use the links in my description box and pinned comment and if you're a new player, you're going to get 100k free silver and a free champion, Hex Weaver. To claim your rewards, all you need to do is click the chest at the top right on the home screen of Raid. All that treasure will be waiting for you for the next 30 days. So click on the links in the description and pin comment and play Raid Shadow Legends today. Okay, so now let's get into the tier list. This is actually wild. This is basically Big Chungus in Super Smash Bros. So let's take a look at Mario. And uh, yeah, Mario looks like Big Chungus. Basically Big Chungus in Smash. <laughs> We're gonna give Mario a C tier because you're gonna see later on that a lot of characters will kind of look like this But a lot of these characters are insane. For example, Donkey Kong. Look at how Donkey Kong looks. You can't even see Donkey Kong's upper body. It is insane. It's just feet. If you put a character's head on that, it would look like this. What is that? What am I looking at right now? So I want to give Donkey Kong an S tier because it's basically feet. Everyone knows I have a foot fetish. So S tier, baby. Now we have Link. Uh, again, just similar to Mario's. It's very big chungusy. It's kind of, you know, head small, body big, but it's nothing insane. So I'm going to give Link a C tier as well. <laughs> Samus looks like she's planking back from whenever that came out, like 2013. I don't even remember when planking was a thing. And Dark Samus looks exactly the same. So I'm going to put Dark Samus and Samus on a C tier. Now we have Yoshi and Yoshi is actually Big Chungus. That is, <laughs> that's looking like Big Chungus. The head is still relatively big, but the body still obviously bigger. But I'm going to give Yoshi a B tier. That facial expression and the big chungus look is beautiful now kirby kirby doesn't change at all uh, a lot of these characters that are just round nothing changes with them and sadly very sadly we're gonna have to put kirby in a d tier the lowest tier there now fox is looking spiffy as all hell i love it that furry man fox is looking like a world-class furry we're gonna give fox a high c tier all right pikachu Okay, Pikachu is, um, Pikachu looks like he ate way too much. What do, what do Pokemon eat? What does Pikachu eat specifically? I don't know. I'm going to Google this. Ah, I see. Pikachu really likes apples and ketchup. Specifically to Ash's Pikachu. I guess Pikachu ate way too much ketchup and exploded. We're going to give Pikachu a B tier. Luigi's looking very similar to Mario, so I'm going to put Luigi on a C tier. Now, Ness... I like the positioning that Ness had. It looks like Ness is really about to shit himself. I'm going to give Ness a B tier. Now, Captain Falcon is glorious. That head to the body is just unnatural. I love it so much. We're going to give Captain Falcon an A tier. Uh, Jigglypuff is very similar to Kirby. Nothing really changes. So we're going to give Jigglypuff a D tier. All right, Peach, what do you got? Honestly, I'm a little disappointed. The head still is pretty small, but it, it kind of matches in a way. I know obviously the arm positioning is just <laughs> so messed up. I'm going to give Peach a very low C tier. I would have put her in D tier, but those arm positioning is just too good. And I'm going to assume that Daisy is very similar. Actually, I don't know if it's the camera angle, but Daisy looks to be a little bit... I guess it's because Peach has a longer glove, but it looks like Daisy's elbow is, is really messed up. But I'm still going to put Daisy right next to Peach. Okay, before I do this, this next one, Bowser... <laughs> I'm not, there's nothing to say about Bowser. Let me just play it. What happened to my boy Bowser? <laughs> oh my goodness. We're putting Bowser at an S tier because Bowser... I don't even know what to describe what that looks like. That's something out of a nightmare that is a sleep paralysis demon right there 
So with Ice Climbers, it works a little bit differently because you can't grab them both at the same time, sadly. So we have Nana and Popo. I believe this is Nana. Nana is looking very just scared out of her mind. And Popo, same way, just terrified. They look very depressed that they're in this situation. And I'm not going to put them in D tier for depressed. I'm not doing that anymore. Haha, <laughs> that joke's dead. I'm going to put Ice Climbers at a C tier. We have Sheik. Uh, Sheik's face doesn't even, <laughs> he can't even see it. It's just completely covered up. It's just hair. It's not Sheik anymore. It's just hair. So I'm going to give Sheik a C tier. Now Zelda should be very similar to Peach and Daisy. So let's take a look. Uh, kind of similar. It's got that same like arm positioning. So I'm going to put Zelda on a C tier. Dr. Mario. Now Dr. Mario, this is really starting to look like Big Chungus. I like this one. Dr. Mario is looking way better than Mario. I think it's more of the lab coat making him just look super fat and bloated. I'm going to give Dr. Mario a B tier. We have Pichu. Uh, from the looks of it, it's gonna look really bad. Oh, honestly, not that bad. Uh, Pichu just looks like a blob. Uh, <laughs> it looks like he's just starting to form into one circle. So I'm gonna give Pichu a C tier. Oh my goodness, now we have Falco. Oh my God. Now Falco has the eyes of pure terror. I wanna give Falco a C tier though. We have Marth. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I love when their head is so small and their body is so massive. I'm gonna give Marth A tier. I messed up. Oh, Lucina, you are looking mighty fine. You looking dummy thick, Lucina. We're giving you a... <laughs> what is Young Link? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh, that's terrifying. I'm giving Young Link a B tier. That is beautiful. All right, Ganon's got to be so good. Oh, <laughs> yep. All right. Ganondorf is on par with Captain Falcon. I'm going to give Ganondorf a... Oh, my goodness. Mewtwo. What is that face, Mewtwo? It's not like overly big. I, I mean, his head is still relatively small to his body. It's not like super small, but that face, that expression he's giving is honestly making the entire thing. I'm going to give Mewtwo a B tier just for that face alone. That is beautiful. And uh, Roy. Okay. Uh, yeah, Roy is looking mighty fine there. Uh, we're going to give Roy an A tier. Krom, A tier. Is this going to... Oh, God. I'm going to give, like, all the Fire Emblem characters an A tier just because they look so stupid. All right, Mr. Game & Watch. Let's see. What is that? Why does Mr. Game & Watch look like a car? Like, the back of him where his legs are, it looks like that's where you would sit. And it, it looks like a motor vehicle. I'm going to give Mr. Game & Watch. And he's smiling, too, by the way. Mr. Game & Watch doesn't smile a lot. We're going to give Mr. Game & Watch an A tier. Oh, Meta Knight. Oh, jeez. Nothing happens with Meta Knight. Worst character in Smash, Meta Knight, right there. So we're going to give Meta Knight a D tier. Oh, is this Pit? Oh my god, Pit. The wings make it so much better. I'm going to give Pit a... I'm going to give him an A tier. That's beautiful. I'm going to assume Dark Pit's very similar. Oh, but the wings are kind of different. That's fine. Pit, Dark Pit and Pit are going in A tier. Hell yeah. Oh my goodness, Zero Suit Samus. Holy moly. How much Mars would love to see you right now. We're going to give Zero Suit Samus a B tier. All right, Wario on Wario action. Um, I... I kind of like it, but it's not its not better than the ones that we've reviewed so far. So I'm going to give Wario a C tier. Snake. Okay. Snake. <laughs> He's kind of dummy thick, not going to lie. Look at those thighs. That is pretty thick compared to his head there. So we're going to give Snake an A tier just because of how thick he is. Look at the grenade compared to his head. The grenade is bigger than his head. That's why I'm giving him an A tier. A lot of, I guess a lot of these Fire Emblem characters are going to be very similar. It's just that small head compared to the body makes it so much better. So I'm going to give Ike an A tier. Buff Ike has like a terrifying expression on his face. All right, Squirtle. Squirtle. <laughs> Squirtle's looking like a Koopa from Mario. We're giving Squirtle a B tier. Ivysaur. That's a very weird. Ivysaur looks very strange. I'm going to give Ivysaur a very high e C tier. It's not B tier material, but it's definitely very high C tier. What the hell is Charizard? Are you joking right now? Charizard looks like he couldn't get it up. It, he looks like a penis. I'm gonna say it. He looks like a penis. I'm giving Charizard an S tier. That's beautiful. Not the penis part, but him. All right. Is this Diddy Kong? Oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> All right. Diddy Kong's face is literally just saying, bruh. <laughs> I'm giving Diddy Kong a B tier. That's funny. All right. Lucas, very similar to Ness. I'm going to put Lucas right next to Ness. Now, Sonic. Sonic, uh, not much different. I guess because Sonic's already kind of small compared to his body, he looks very weird. He also is just making a terrified face. So I'm going to give Sonic just a C tier. All right. King DDD. 
<laughs> what, are, what am I looking at? You know what it looks like? It looks like one of those um, Jamaican beanies. You know, you go to Jamaica, you get one of those beanies from the, the, the resort or wherever you go. That is, King DDD just turned into a Jamaican beanie. I love it. We're going to give King DDD's nuts an S tier. Alamar's <laughs> kind of out of his helmet there. He's halfway to dying from nowhere. <laughs> this spaceman is almost dead. I love it. We're going to give Elf and Alamar. We're going to give them a B tier. Oh, Lucario, not so good. We're going to give Lucario a C tier. All right, Rob. Okay. <laughs> what is that? What am I looking at right now? Rob looks like an Atari controller. <laughs> We're giving Rob an S tier. That is beautiful. We got my boy Toon Link, and Toon Link is not looking that good. I think Young Link was a lot better, so we're going to give Toon Link a C tier. We got Wolf. Wolf just looks like he's constipated. I mean, every single tier list I've done, Wolf is usually constipated. We're going to give Wolf a C tier. We have Villager. I love the expressions from Villager and Isabel. They're so good, but it's not just the expression. I do have to rate the overall body and head and everything. It's not crazy good, but we're going to give Villager a C tier. You know, Mega Man, uh, Mega Man. I don't know how to explain Mega Man. I really don't. It just looks super weird. We're going to give Mega Man a C tier. I got, I want you guys to write in the comment Mega Man and then caption what he is saying in this image right here. All right, we fit trainer. <laughs> That's a bruh face. The Wii Fit Trainer is a bruh moment. We're giving Wii Fit Trainer an A tier. That's beautiful. Rosalina and Luma, not that crazy. She looks very normal for the most part. The hair is a little messed up. So we're going to give Rosalina and Luma, we're going to give her a D tier. And we have Little Mac. Little Mac looks extremely buff, but his head is super small. It's like he missed head day. Uh, it's, like, it's like he missed head day. That makes no sense. Whatever. Little Mac is getting a C tier. Now we have Greninja. Greninja doesn't look any different. Uh, he looks very similar. We're going to give Greninja a D tier. Oh, I have Politana. <gasps> oh my goodness, that head. That looks horrifying. We're giving Politana a B tier. Pac-Man doesn't look any different. He's just okay. So obviously we're going to put Pac-Man at a D tier. Robin is looking crazy as all hell. I want to see girl Robin with the hair. I was really hoping that the hair would go everywhere and just crazy. But we're going to put Robin right next to all the Fire Emblem characters because it's very similar. Now we have Shulk. And Shulk has a... Okay, that's amazing. <laughs> we're giving Shulk an A tier. And we have Bowser Jr. And obviously we have all the different types. Uh, not crazy. They look exactly the same. So we're going to give Bowser Jr. a D tier. Now we have Duck Hunt. And it, the only thing that changes is like where he b b bites down. It's not that good. We're going to give Duck Hunt a D tier. Now we have Ryu. Oh my god. Ryu is buff as all hell and a super small head. That is going in A tier. Ken is going to be very similar. <laughs> buff as all hell. Going in A tier, buddy. We have Cloud. Oh my god. <laughs> Cloud is pretty great. We're going to give Cloud a B tier. We have Corrin. Oh my goodness, Corrin. What the heck? Corrin's kind of similar to all the Fire Emblem characters, so we're just going to put Corrin right next to that. Bayonetta has those wide ass shoulders, and we're going to put Bayonetta in a B tier. Inkling, for the most part, is very basic, very similar to a lot of the C-tier characters with that arm movement that she's got going on. So I'm going to give Inkling and Boy Inkling a C-tier. Now we have Ridley. Oh my god, I actually cannot wait. Ridley's one of the biggest characters. I can't wait to see this. Oh my god. You know what? Add to that Mega Man comment. Go ahead and edit your comment, boys, because I want you to add Mega Man caption. Ridley caption. I want to know what Ridley's thinking right now. Ridley's going in an S-tier. That is freaking fantastic. Oh my goodness. The different Ridley skins really make a difference. Holy shit, what am I looking at right now? We have Richter and Simon. They're going to be very similar. So, uh, again, I like it. It's very similar to Ken and Ryu. So, I'm going to put Richter and Simon right next to Ken and Ryu. Oh, God. Ken King K. What are you going to look like? Oh, my God. King K rule. You looking good, boy. You're going in an S tier. We have Isabel. I'm kind of disappointed in Isabel. I thought it'd be a lot better. So I'm going to put Isabel right next to Villager. <laughs> Incineroar is looking so wide. <laughs> Why does he look so wide? <laughs> We're giving Incineroar an A tier. So now we have the DLC characters. And Piranha Plant is up first. And Piranha Plant just looks a like a tiny plant in a, in a pot. I love it. I think it's hilarious. So we're going to give Prana Plant an A tier. We have Joker. And Joker's doing a very similar animation to a lot of the C tier ones. But I kind of like it. I feel like the trench coat really adds to the entire character. It's kind of funny. I'm loving it. So I'm going to give Joker 
a B tier. We have Hero. Hero is also doing that same C tier pose kind of there. Hero is not much different from a lot of the C tier characters, so I'm gonna give Hero a C tier. We have Banjo, and Banjo is just Jesus. Like, look at that bear. His feet are so much bigger than his head, and I love it. I also tried it with Kazooie, like if you're holding Kazooie and then you try to get eaten up, because I wanted to bring Kazooie out, but that doesn't work, sadly. I'm still gonna give Banjo an A tier. Now we have Terry, and it's very similar to Ryu and Ken, like that small head, big body sort of thing, but I think it's better, so I'm gonna give Terry a high A tier. We have Byleth, the worst character ever added to Smash, haha <laughs> XD. Uh, and nothing insane. I'm gonna give Byleth a C tier. We have a Mii Fighter. This one's called Kill Me. Um, and I think a lot of the Mii Fighters are the same, so I'm only gonna do just this Mii Fighter. So I'm gonna give the Mii Fighters a C tier. And that's it, everybody. That's the tier list. Thanks for watching. Remember to check out Raid Shadow Legends. Please use the like and dislike button to its actual purpose. If you guys actually like these kind of tier lists, please like the video, but if you don't, just dislike it. It's all right. I won't be offended. And if you did dislike it, give me a comment saying why. I want to improve, I want to make better content, and I want to continue to grow and evolve. So thanks for watching, guys. Remember to unsub for my channel, and peace. Whoop.